21 years ago, Ragtime became a hit Broadway show. The Tony-winning musical follows the story of three groups of citizens in New York at the turn of the century. So you have a group that is from Harlem, a group from New Rochelle, and a group that is brand new from various countries. And so it just talks about how these stories intertwine with one another and uh, how they all affect each other's lives. The show starts with these three groups being at odds and really not being very fearful. Uh, a lot of it is fear-based. And you hear that melody in that song of these people that are so different. Mm -hmm. And then you hear those three representatives singing once again, the immigrant and the new Rochelle in Younger Brother and Cole House saying they are the same for that moment. And then the final moment, seeing those three little kids who each are a representative of those three groups, to me is the story. Ragtime is a social piece about the treatment of African Americans and immigrants at the time and includes scenes of a young black woman being beaten to death by the police. You really realize that it's still the same story that keeps happening. The Philando Castiles, the Sandra Blands, the Trayvon Martins, the Stephon Clark, which just happened recently, and Alton Sterling. It's the same story, and it's kind of unfortunate that, you know, to have this fictional story of 1906 that's still happening today. Why this is so relevant today is that we live in a world where people don't want to have conversations. People are angry and unwilling, and this is a representation of a conversation that got started. And it it would be crazy to say nothing has changed. That's a little over dramatic, but it is striking that in some cases so little has changed. There are so many dinner table conversations right now that are uncomfortable uh, because people are so angry and so divided. And what a great way to maybe have a tipping point to have a conversation that is difficult. It's gonna make you feel sad, angry, happy. It's gonna give you all the emotions that you need to feel. And it's gonna provoke you know those conversations that we need to have as Americans, as people. Ragtime is now playing at Midtown Arts Center.